he had wind of what I was writing in my doctoral thesis, and he lived it also in the same area, and he took exception to it about its writing. Okay. Mm. Uh, the other thing is that I've come to realise that the whole basis on which I had written the doctrine really needed to be rethought. So like it's a big, it's a profound level of thinking, but it's it's based on a false premise. We we built so much of the uh, of the church that I was brought up in on the idea that God created the world, Adam sinned, and then Jesus redeemed the world, and it was a new creation. And Paul talks about a new Adam, that Christ is the new Adam. Whereas the point is, Christ is the completion of the first Adam, not a new Adam. But once you took that division, that's what the, all the church's teaching was based on, was on this division between the old Adam and the new Adam. Between the creation and the redemption. Between, between creation and redemption. Whereas creation, the completion of creation, is what Jesus is about. Mm. Where we have to, just as we come out of nothing in creation, it is when we accept our own powerlessness, our nothingness, if you like, and then God can fill us with all we are, all He is. And that is why, the, what is not stressed in our teaching, that the destiny of all human beings is to be sons of God as Jesus, Joshua, mm. is. 